On Saturday, November 27, 2022, hundreds of people were having a great time at the Winter Wonderland Fair in the capital of Wales, Cardiff, in the United Kingdom, when suddenly they heard a very loud and disturbing bang that was followed by screams of pain and agony. Some people rushed in the direction of the noise as panic filled the place. They found a nightmarish scene at a travelling ride called the Ice Skater and staff members attending to three women who had been seriously injured after the ride malfunctioned mid-ride. Some of the spectators were near the ride at the time of the crash went into shock and required medical attention after seeing the ride crash and people getting ejected from their seats violently. They thought the three women on the ground were dead. The atmosphere at the fair went from happy and joyous to sad and terrified. People simply did not expect something so horrific to take place at the family-friendly fair. Stay tuned for all the details of the ice skater ride incident at the Winter Wonderland Fair in Cardiff that caused three sisters to sustain serious injuries. Cardiff is the capital and largest city of Wales in the United Kingdom. It's a beautiful place and in 2011 it ranked 6th in the world in a National Geographic magazine list of alternative tourist destinations. One of Cardiff's most loved winter events is the Winter Wonderland Fair. In 2022 the fair started on November 15th and ended on January 8th, 2023. And, as usual, the fair attracted hundreds of thousands of locals and visitors from around the United Kingdom. Not only is the experience at the fair quite enjoyable, but the locations of the fair itself are quite prestigious. We said locations because the fair is split across two different locations. The fair offers everything that can be said to be winter fun for both the young and old alike. From ice rinks for skating under the stars, ice bars, delicious food and drinks to amusement rides that make people look forward to next year's fair. Most of the amusement rides including the Ice Skater are based outside of the City Hall location. The rides include the popular Big Wheel with views across Cardiff, the merry-go-rounds, big and small waltzers and a few fairground classics. The Winter Wonderland Fair also has a reputation for being very safe and there have been only a few minor incidents over the years. However, the 2022 season was different due to a horrific incident involving the ice skater ride that nearly claims three lives. The ice skater is a sizzler type ride. It is also called scrambler, twist, twister, cha-cha or merry mixer, all depending on its location. It is an amusement ride in which suspended riders spinning in cars experience centrifugal force while spinning along two separate axes. Riders are seated in small carriages clustered together and connected by beams at top to central point. The clustered vehicles are spun in one direction while the ride as a whole spins in the opposite direction. It's a fun ride and suitable for almost all ages. However, clones of the ride at other locations across the world claimed at least six lives since 1997. In a nutshell, it's an innocent looking but deadly ride. Let's now take a deep look into the horrific incidents that should not have happened. Around 5.15 on Saturday, November 27th, 2022, the Winter Wonderland Fair was packed with people when a sad and unfortunate incident took place. Witnesses say they heard a very loud bang followed by chaos and panic. As these witnesses turned around to see what had happened, they found that the ice skater rides had malfunctioned, but somehow was still going. And they also saw a lady on the floor and the second lady who was pushed between the railings and the cart, and the railings had bent. 13-year-old Saren McCallum was at the fair at the time, celebrating her birthday along with her family and some friends. She witnessed the whole thing and also saw a third lady thrown into the railings as the staff desperately tried to stop the ride, which was not cooperating and refused to stop. At least two minutes had passed before the staff finally managed to bring the ride to a complete halt. 
It was a miracle that the malfunctioning rise kept running did not kill one of the three women or injure the patrons in the other carriages. One of the women was bleeding from her head and the other was unconscious. The witness added, I was panicking. You see things like this happening on YouTube and hear them happening to other people, but it's scary when it happens to you. Children were crying and even some adults were sobbing from the horror and fear that someone might have died right in front of them at such a happy and fun family place. Soon the ambulance services arrived and medics began transferring the victims who had not been identified to the University Hospital of Wales. According to one source, the three women are sisters in their 20s. 29-year-old Laura Rogers was playing on the games opposite the ice skater ride when she and her family heard a commotion and saw security personnel frantically running all over the place. She witnessed one of the three sisters trying to get up and seemed to be in great pain, crying as the ride operators were pulling off one of the railings to reach one of her sisters who was pinned against it. Nearby, the third sister was on the ground with blood next to her head. She was also unconscious. Laura also saw the women's shoes scattered all over the place, which happened during the horrific crash and is a testament to its horrific extent. Laura's mother was very concerned about what she was seeing and the victims on the ground, so she decided to go and ask one of the staff who was coordinating the area. He told her that a carriage safety bar flung open mid-ride for unknown reasons, causing the three women to be ejected from their seats and slam into the ride's door. Laura was shocked and horrified because her five-year-old daughter had taken the ride before and had told her earlier just before the incident that she wanted to go on the ice skater, which, despite her age, she was able to go on because she was a little over the allowed limit of 3.9 feet. The Cardiff Winter Wonderland Fair Management and the Welsh Police soon announced that a full investigation into the incident was already taking place, but they did not elaborate on the victim's status nor identified them due to legal issues. The Winter Wonderland Fair opened as expected the next day, Sunday, November 28th, but the ice skater ride was not running and was removed by December 1st and replaced by another family-friendly ride. The Cardiff City Council, which approved the ride at the fair, also announced that they will be supporting any investigations. It is said that one of the sisters suffered a broken ankle and another suffered a broken leg and fractured rib. Both were released from hospital the next day. However, it's not clear what happened to the third sister, because she did spend a few days at the hospital, and the extent of her injuries was not announced. Additionally, since the incident is recent, the investigation is still ongoing, and there are no new reports from the authorities. Do you live in Cardiff or Wales? Do you have any information about the three sisters and what happened to them since the incident? If you do, please let us know in the comments section. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, share, subscribe and hit the bell button to get notified every time we upload a new video that will take you to the heart of the scenes and mysteries of some of the most terrifying incidents, accidents disasters and paranormal events from around the world.